Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Welcome to my another video on Android app development First of all uh, I would request you to please subscribe to my channel Programming Experts if you have not already subscribed Alright so let's get started So in this video I will be teaching you guys on how to use a list view with a search filter So let's get started First of all we uh, let me create an Android project name of list view with search app all right so the project is now being created let us wait so uh, in this video I will be using uh, an edit text and a list view so we will uh, we will be able to search uh, the list items of the list view so I will show you how to achieve that so the project is now ready first of all let me set the now what I need to do is I need to uh, display the layout so for that I need a plain text for search filter First of all, I need to remove those four values. What is the error? Let me remove this. So I again need to drag the edit text. So now our edit text is there. Now we need a list view. So this will be our uh, custom list view. First of all, let us initialize the edit text and the list view. So edit text e1 list view l1 all right now we need to link that to the layout So now what we need to do is we need to create a custom layout for our list view items. So for that we need to initialize a new layout and I rename it as list item. So 
so in here I will grab attack view and I will be using the repairing feature 10 dp so what we need to do is now we need to go to our main activity.java file and we need to initialize the string items we also need to initialize array adapter this array adapter will be containing our list items adapter now another thing what we need is an array list so we need to initialize first of all we need to initialize the items new new string Uh, first of all, I name the countries as Pakistan, India, United States, United Kingdom, West Indies, Afghanistan, Brazil, Colombia, Palo. So this this is the this view items which will be displaying on our list view so another thing we need to initialize is the array list new array list in here i need to write arrays dot as list and i will put it items there Now I need to install the adapter. What I need in this here is this pointer, then r dot layout dot list item, this list item. All right, and I need the, the reference of uh, text view, and I need to pass the array list here all right as we have uh, initialized our array list our array adapter so what we need to do is we need to enable the filter for our list view so for that i need to write l1 dot set text filter enabled and i am change it to true so what next i need is I need to set the adapter. So, adap uh, set adapter, adapter. All right. Now, if I run the program, let's see what happens. Let me connect my Android phone with my PC. So, I need to run run the app. let me open
it's a bit slow so you have to wait a bit So now the app is running on my Android phone. Let me show you. So now I need to run as you can see our application is now running since I have not uh, included the search facility in my application so this will, uh, is not working so our next step is to use the search filter so for that we need to use the edit text, uh, add text, change listener, new text watcher. We need to use the text watcher. So in here we have three methods: before text change, on text change, and after text change. So we just need to write the code: this dot main activity. main activity dot this dot adapter dot get filter dot filter and in here we need to provide the character sequence and finally we need to call the notify data set change all right so our application is now complete let me run the program application now our application is, is running but now when I PAK as you can see Pakistan is showing if I press A you can see Afghanistan W West Indies United States So if you like the video please subscribe to my channel thank you and goodbye